Hi you guys, welcome to my channel. I'm Leslie and today we're going to be doing my November favorites. Um, Christmas time is my favorite time of the year, okay? Like it's the most wonderful time of the year. Um, it, it, I can't explain how excited I am. It's not because of presents or anything like that. It's just, everything is just kind of different. Um, the love is in the air. You can feel families get more connected. It's, it's crazy. But November has been a really good one for me. I've got to accomplish a lot of things that I never thought I would ever be able to accomplish. And it's not about material things or anything like that. It just has been things that I couldn't stand up to myself for or things that I got to accomplish with my families, my friends. It's just a bucket list of stuff that I like I never thought that I would be able to accomplish I did. So yeah, I hope you guys had a good November as well. If you did, please write in the comments down below. I would really love to see I would really love to read them and, and, and see and get an idea of who you guys really are, who are watching the videos. Okay, so in this video, I'm going to be talking really loud just because I'm trying to talk over my fan. Um, I hope you guys are liking this new setup, light setup that I have. Uh, it's impossible for me to film in the daytime. I just don't have the time to, I'm sorry. So I have my lights set up at night. It's like 12 o'clock at night right now, but I wanted to make sure that I got this video up and ready to go. So yeah, um, my favorites are behind me. These are my favorites. And yeah, let's get into it. The first thing I want to talk about is uh, this little box here. Oh, this box is life to me right now. Um, everything about it is kind of like amazing. Do you guys see the packaging? Do you guys see that? Do you see it? Do you see what's going on? Do you see how amazing it is? Are you loving it? Okay, yeah. So MAC launched the glitter collection this month. Um, and all their glitters and pigments and stuff like that. They had a collection going ahead. I think they had gold. They had... The, the smoky eye look. They had um, the pink one, of course. Is that one more? I feel like there's one more, but I think that's more of the lip collection, the gloss. I don't know. But I did get the pink one and I got the gold one. Um, I didn't want to get the gold one just because I had um, a couple of stuff that was in the gold one. And I do have um, one thing from this one here, which is the rose pigment. Um, that is this one here. But I gave that one to my friend so that. I cannot have it and feel even more excited about my collection. So yeah, I got the rose pigment. I also got the, what's this one here? What, um, the Heritage Rouge, which is really, really nice. I got tan pigment. I also got, what's this here? Whisper Pink, which is really pretty. And I got, um, Raining Riches, which is what I have on my lid right now. I absolutely love this collection. Um, this is one of my favorite collections that i ever gotten from MAC. Keeping on the eyes, I want to stay on the eyes. Um, I, know a lot of, I know a lot of you guys have heard about Morphe. Morphe brushes, Morphe eyeshadows. It's amazing how... It's crazy. Let me just show you guys the palette first. I've been using this palette for over two months now. I, like, even, like, right now, I have on... Let me show you guys without, breaking, you know, break, blinding you. I have this color right here in my crease with this color to darken it up and the black on the outer. You guys, it's crazy. This palette is so pigmented. I haven't tried the single eyeshadows. I guess they're like the same thing, right? They're like individual. Eye. Yeah. So I got the entire palette because I was like, okay, I love this one. I'm going to get this one. Plus, um, I got the Jaclyn Hill discount. And the eyeshadows, the pink, the palette itself was already the cheapest thing in the world, but I got the discount anyway, and it was like even cheaper. When I got this, I, I'm normally excited about palettes, and I like to make my own palettes, but I think they did a really good job of making this palette for me. Alright, for highlight. Okay. Okay. This is the Mineralize Skin Finish. And... Tell me, if you can see this very well, if my light is not freaking this up, you will see that this is the most beautiful thing. Come on, you guys. I don't know if you guys can really see what's going on right here. I don't know. Is, is my hair not in the way? Like, come on. This is life. This is life. If you haven't got your hands on this yet, I don't know. Is this collection? I don't. I wanted to talk about collection items, you guys, because you guys can get your hands on it, but... I'm gonna mention another eye product to you here, you guys. This is Light Touch, this is a pressed pigment. I'm sure, I'm not sure. I'm lying if I say I'm sure, but I'm not sure. You can find this, you guys. 
it's a press pick and shade. I have a look. Now for me, I don't wear this straight up on the eyes. Not unless it's like New Year's or, you know, something really big going on. Oh, there it is. It's this one right here. But I do put this on top of like eyeshadow. So if I'm doing my like a brown smoky eye, I would put a little bit of this on top of pressed pigment. I might even mention that. Am I saying like real words? Like, I feel like I'm not. Okay. When I'm doing brown smoky eyes, I would just put a little bit of this on top. And you guys, it's phenomenal. It's phenomenal? Is it phenomenon? It's like phenomenal. It's phenomenal. Right. When I put this on, it's phenomenal. Everybody asks me questions about it. Like, what are you wearing? Like, oh my god, it's so pretty. I'm not sure if this is a collection item. I'm not sure. Why am I not sure about these things? I should know these things. I'm a Maconite. I should know, like, stuff. But I don't know if this is permanent or not. But I love it. If you do get a chance to get your hands in, please do so. It's amazing. Okay, two blushes. Mm. This one here is full of joy. This is a frost finish blush. Let me see if I can get the color to actually show up for you guys to see. Frost finishing blush. Blushes is one of my favorites. You guys see the color in that? It's like, like a lavender color. Do you guys see how pretty that is? And... I have a lot of these favorites like this month just because I've had a drawer full of stuff that I haven't been using and I was like this month I'm going to be using a ton of this crap I don't care what happens I'm going to use this and I find that I am loving all of this stuff like it's amazing do you guys see that blush right there that is full of joy frost finish oh my goodness the next one here is red for beauty I'm swatching it so you guys can get that you guys can see it come on you guys tell me that isn't life trust me amazing if you can't get your hands on it do you guys see that right here my hand is full of swatches but the most thing the most bold thing on my hand you can see right here is this blush okay get it you're gonna love it this perfume here is the Katy Perry killer queen I think this is a blue one I don't know if they have like specific names I do have the red one I don't have the big one to the red one but I have the smaller one this reminded me so much of Juicy Couture um, what's that one the one with the the bigger square bottle this reminded me so much of that uh, but it was like okay just got why didn't I just get Juicy Couture no this one smelled a little bit better it was like it doesn't have like that oh my god it's so strong it might be a male cologne type of scent it's just like hey you smell nice i've always said that i don't like to buy like famous people's perfume or makeup or anything that they kind of like bring out just because i feel like sometimes it's not really they're not really it's not really smell that good or anything like that or they're not really investing that much time in it my opinion um, but I did buy, buy this just because I work in an area where perfumes are being sold anyway. So I was like, okay, let me just smell it. Tried it out for that day. Loved it. It stayed on me all day. One, that's the most important thing for me. If a perfume can stay on me all day, I'm down. So I got this one here. I got the big bottles with this. I know I'm going to love it. I normally don't get big bottles of perfumes because I never use perfume that much. But this one here, I've been loving it and I've been using it so much, you guys. It's amazing the blue bottle perfume if you do please life you get me yeah let's talk about a couple of things for my face i think i have talked about this foundation before i don't know if i mentioned it i did mention it in my what's in my bag video i didn't go into details about it i carry this foundation everywhere i go it's the hd n177 i went in tested for this bought like four bottles of this one shot i tried it it was amazing on my skin Okay, the last two products. Yes, the video is almost over. I know that's what you guys are saying. I know you guys watch videos because I do too, and you're like, thank God it's almost over. But you watch anyway, right? <laughs> so yeah, the first one I want to talk about, this is Living Legend. It's more of a brownie plum color. No, I lied. It's a brownie reddish color. It's more, it, just, it reminds me so much of Sin Diva in that area of color, but darker. You guys see that or maybe sin is darker than this i'm not sure 
I still invested in, in it anyway because I thought it was really, really pretty and it does look really, really nice on me. It's amazing. I will, if I, um, if I have a picture of me wearing it, I will put it somewhere so you guys can see. If not, you guys will have to, you know, look at the swatch. I, I forget to take pictures all the time. I'm, I'm bad at that. The last one I want to talk about here, this one is Smoked Purple. I don't feel like I have to do a swatch of it because it's on my lips. Yeah. I did um, wear this in my last favorites video. I think that was August. I think it was my August favorites. I didn't think I do a September favorites. I'm not sure. I don't I doubt I did one. But if I did, it was in my last favorites video. I would put the link for it down below. I have been wearing this a lot. So that's all for my favorites for the month. I do hope you guys enjoyed this video, and I will see you guys in my next one. Bye, you guys. Have a great day.